I would have to describe Winter Drumline to someone who does not know what it, what it is as a mixture of artistic expression, team building, and musical uh, education. Hi, I'm Eric Cruikshank, and I am the, one of the co-directors here at Southgate Winter Percussion. I do some of the musical design as well as some of the visual design. My name is Brendan Walter and I'm the band director here. Um, I'm also the co-director for Southgate Winter Percussion with Eric. So my time with the activity has been pretty extensive. Uh, I started marching in 2006 when I was in high school. Uh, I went on to college band, did drum corps, did uh, indoor percussion for many, many years. And I've been teaching now since like 2010. I have been involved in this activity since 2006. I did all throughout high school and then um, when I went to college I did drum corps. I was a teacher first in 2010 all the way up to 2022 which is this year. Um, so I've been in the activity for about 16 years now. I think this activity combines the marching arts, like marching band, um, but it's just drumline and it's in a gym. We use a lot of different uh, props. It's a smaller scale and it's a, it's a worldwide activity that uh, many high schools participate in as well as groups that are older, as in like college age. Southgate Winter Percussions show this year is entitled I'll Be Watching You, which is a, essentially it's a play on uh, monsters under the bed. The idea is that our character goes to sleep and the demons or the monsters under the bed come out and are wreaking havoc both in her world as well as the dreamscape that they are a part of. Our mindset from this is no longer new, this is something we need to improve upon each time we play it. Yeah? Like, if we're coming into rehearsal with a, oh, I got this new part of free music, like, that's the wrong mentality. So, preparation uh, for the end of the season begins kind of at the beginning of the season. We, as a staff, will sit around and we'll discuss how do we want this production to go. Public performances where we get feedback from judges and we're able to make adjustments that help the production realize its true potential. Well, I definitely think um, that these programs are really important because they really give kids an outlet. Um, I have many kids that couldn't find a place that they felt like was their home. They came to the band program and, and they found their home. This is way worse than doing the dishes. Christmas. No, just pull, just pull, just pull. So today is going to be pretty laid back, right? It's not like a regular show performance. We're going to kind of go out there and like just have some fun with it. Um, when we go out there, just make sure that you guys are like thinking through the things that we've been working really, really hard to get through. Yeah? yeah. You guys have worked way too hard to like go out there and kind of not have a good run today. Like go out there and enjoy it and like. Give it your best effort and you guys will be pleasantly surprised with like the reaction you will get from the crowd. Cool? Yeah. What I would like them to take from us here is that putting in the work is worth it at the end of the day. Um, even if you don't do as well as you'd like to competitively or you're not as successful as you'd like to be, the process is what's important. I'll be watching you. A selfie. Return to